Hello, YouTube. It's Dee Blast. How's everybody? SoundCloud, the Black Madonna. Um, I just want to, uh, uh, you know, touch in. Uh, I did three videos up, up, uplifting my black men. And do y'all know why? Neither one of those videos uh, went through. The message says, black men, I know that all of you are not drug dealers and gangsters. All of you don't have a whole lot of babies all over the place. Some of you don't, but I'm speaking to the ones that do. Stop having all of them babies like that over here, over there, over here, over there. Y'all yeah, men, how you going to live with a woman and everything, conceive a baby, but the relationship is over, so you leave the baby too? You don't come back and check the baby? You don't want to pay child support? You don't. So what? It's in her hands. She's cashing it. She's taking care of the child. Now, neither one of you motherfuckers that's paying your child support, the woman is doing wrong with the money. Neither one of you. She's doing right with the money. And I think it's fucked up for you to want to make a baby and then turn around and leave and then make another baby and then turn around. You got babies all over the place. Well, I'll tell you where that came from. Back in slavery time, huh, not only did they give our babies to the alligators, huh, not only did they feed our toddlers to the alligators, did all you dumb niggas out there, the pimps, all of y'all, to stay out of gator shoes. Gator shoes are made from alligators. Uh, during slavery time, when they brought, first brought us over here, they took all of our two, three-year-olds and threw them in the river so the, uh, uh, the uh, uh, alligators can eat and get really plump so they can make purses and shoes that you dumb niggas, I got gators. Throw them gators in the goddamn garbage. Your ancestors is dead in them gators. Okay, so it seems like when I want to say something respectable to my people, it's not going to go on YouTube. See, when I want to say something um, respectable and encouraging to my black men who are with their families, black men who have bank accounts, black men who helps pay the bills, black men who's the only one paying the bills at one point, you understand what I'm saying? It is some good men out there that love their children. They be there for their children. They go to the game with their children. You know, they, they take their children diff different places. You know, every black man is not a sorry-ass man. There's a, a percentage that are a sorry-ass black man, but not all of them. Not all of them. Men, get up and go to work every day. Find one woman. And build a life. If you and you're coming up on your 40s, you and your 40s, it's time you break the brook, a baby. And get yourself asked to being a man. And run that household. And help that lady with the bills and kids. You understand? I hate a nigga, you know, that's still coming to your house. But he don't want to help you pay. He don't want to help you do shit. But he getting big plates, pork chops, and cute steak. And, oh, he eating up. And all he got to offer is dick. That's the kind of black man that I say them white bitches can have. Now, I say black bitches, and I'm going to say white bitches. When I say white bitches, it shuts off. Now, how is it that I'm giving a, an encouragement speech to my peoples, for my men's is to know that y'all not all sorry. When us some black women, when we talk about sorry-ass black men, we're not talking about all of y'all. Because it is some good men out there. It really is, you know. And I look forward to getting married again. I look forward to meeting me. I don't need a man, you know. But I want one. You know, and um, and he's going to be accordingly. You women have to find men. Have your own agenda. They say men have agenda. Have your own agenda. Why are you with this man? Why are you choosing this man? What does this man do for you in your heart and in physical? What does he do for you? That's how you make your decision. If you love him, he still make your heart flutter and butterflies. Stay with him. And y'all work it out. Stop breaking up. Stop having other babies. Men, stop cheating. Choose one woman. All cats are gray in the dark. You know? Okay, so um, I just wanted to just touch bases, you know. I, I just don't want the guys to think that Dee Dee Blast is a battle axe about black men because I'm not. And there's a lot of black men that I respect. I respect my father. He's passed. You know, I respect my brother. Strange dude. But I love my brother and I respect him. You understand? And I respect all black men. Yes, I do. Uh, and, and, and fellas, I know sometimes you want to go outside your race, but stay in your race. Stay in your race. But trust me, you'll be, you'll be, <laughs> stay in your race, okay? 
um, uh, you know, I plan to stay in mine and my children plan to stay in theirs and my family, you know, uh, you know, we do have some, um, half breeds in the family, but basically what I'm saying is 100% black family standing right here talking to you. And I'm a strong woman. I love my children. I love my house. I love to take care of my house. I love to work. I like to do everything. I love everything. Now there's some things that I don't like and that person or whoever it may be will find it out quick. What I don't like and what I don't accept. See ladies? You got to tell them what you don't like and what you're not going to accept. So you have to have that in mind as well. So don't be looking for niggas to take care of you. Don't be looking for niggas, you know, asking if you know money, money, money. If he give you money, he going to give you money on his own. If he a good nigga and he know you paid all your bills and you a good woman, he going to slide money to you. He will. Because he know you're going to do something with it. See, you give me money. Hmm. I'm going to play ahead on the bills. I'm going to look there for socks and underwears and, and, um, you know, wash the clothes and get some food up in the house, you know, and just, you know, do my thing, you know. So that is if you gave Didi money. Didi don't believe in blowing money. Now, there is some guys out there that will share his check and you share your check. We should share the check together. We make the bills, you know, you know, and have a nice family and cook and, you know, have a beautiful, lovely family. We can do that, y'all. We did it in the 70s. We could do it again. We really can. We did it in the 30s, the 40s, the 60s, the 70s. It's like right around 70s, 80s, you know, marriages disappeared. Everybody's divorced. It's just terrible. So I wish everyone in the world a whole lot of luck and a whole lot of love. And I, I want to be able to uh, be there, you know, if I need to be uh, for my people, if I need to be. Uh, other people as well, you know, if they want to join on and uh, get some great information and then and then they'll get some good news at the same time, you know, that's very good. You know, so anybody's welcome to the page, you know, just come on and subscribe. Subscribe, you know. Um, I have a few people that I had invited to my page. That I like them a lot. They're other YouTubers. <laughs> it's a few YouTubers that I really like a lot. All right, I want to shout out to Anita B. Hey, Anita B. Marketing. <laughs> I want to shout out to Mr. Good. Hey, Mr. Good. I want to shout out to D.A. Dufine. I want to shout out to T.T. I want to shout out, who else I want to shout I want to shout out Pat Pastor Michael Michael Smith. Uh, let's see who else I want to shout out. Oh, I want to shout out Mary Forty. I want to shout out Mac, Versatile Mac. I want to shout out Pookie TVX. Uh, let's see who else, who else, who else. Oh, Tasha K. I'm lying with Tasha K. Uh, let's see who else, who else, who else. Who, uh, Wally. I like our mind show, but we don't uh, communicate. I have tried to communicate with him, but uh, he doesn't uh, answer back. Uh, but anyway, shout out to our mind because he said, her be original, bitch. <laughs> All right, uh, so um, I'm going to go now, guys. All right, this is just an encouragement. Ladies, an encouragement for you as well. Uh, keep yourself safe. Keep the kids safe. Keep yourself safe. Keep your legs closed until you find somebody worthy, someone who you find worthy. Not what other people think. What do you think? Do you like him? If he's not a woman user, he's not a woman beater, a liar, cheater, harasser, none of that. If he's none of that, ha, the hell would people say, go on out with the guy. You understand? So uh, those temper dudes, leave them temper dudes alone, ladies. Because they ain't going to do nothing but whoop your ass. Ladies, stay away from men whose mama didn't take care of them good, honey. Because they hate women from deep sea. So don't get no nigga that hate his mother. Because he going to treat you like shit. He going to whoop your ass. And once a nigga put his hands on you to whoop your ass, he going to whoop your ass again. You leave. Huh? But when you come back, he going to whoop your ass again worse than he did the last time. So leave them tempered niggas alone. I eat them for breakfast. I ain't scared of no timid nigga. No tempered nigga. But I just don't have time for a tempered nigga. You know, I don't. I don't got time for no angry nigga shit. I just don't. We are right. We don't need that. Be angry and stuff. Just live your life. Be happy. Somebody prejudiced, so what? Let them be prejudiced. That's them. The day ain't call you no nigga, right? So then you straight. You straight. Just come off the angry nigga shit. I'm conscious, you know, but I'm not angry. The stuff can make you angry, what you learn and what happened to our people can make you angry. But it's your job. You still have to do the research. All right? So I've taken a break from black history for a moment to, just to gather myself. But I will be jumping back up into it. And I will put a little bit on here about things that we need to know. All right? So uh, no alligator shoes at all. Stop that. No alligator shoes. Okay? All right, everybody stay together. Love your wife. Love your husband. Love your children. Children, respect your parents. 
Make sure you're respecting your parents, okay? All right, well, I love you all. I really do, you know, for taking the time to listen to me, you know. This is an encouragement video video uh, for uh, uh, my black sisters and to my black men. Says, yes, yes, you got to stand up, man, and be a man now. This whole world about to go crazy. You better have a, fa a family, you know what I mean, guys? Okay, well, I love you, black men, I do. I really do. Uh, but you are uh, child molesters and pedophiles and rapers and murderers. Uh, y'all could get locked up. The white bitch can have y'all. All right, I'm going to get off. Y'all have a good day, okay? All right, uh, bye.